What a running start right back to the backfield for him. Yeah, he really didn't give anybody a chance to get up there and stop him. No, I mean, that's really, really difficult. You're asking a whole lot anyway, but when he gets that kind of a start and comes through clean, oftentimes the advantage definitely goes to the defensive player. And a great job here. This is going to turn out to be a beauty. This is marked down at about the three-yard line. That is how you flip field position. That's an absolute bomb of a punt. Downs it inside the five-yard line. Absolutely ideal. From that position, you're hoping to get it down inside the 15, inside the five. Superb. The Bengals drive about to get going. And they will start this drive with just terrible field position backed up inside their own five. But we have seen teams be bold here and take shots, right? Sometimes you go max protection, make it a one receiver route, and take your shot downfield and see what happens. And occasionally, we've seen success occur. Trying to find some space to operate, and now they'll have it a gain of 12, a big first down to get away from the end zone. I guess it's good we can't really read the mind of the defensive coordinator now, huh? Had them pinned back there deep, give up that run. Can't be happy. Yeah, whatever was whatever is in his mind right now, we probably couldn't say over the air. Escaping the pressure right. They'll get just a yard on the scramble. It's second down. How about a tip of the cap to the defense? They're working against a very mobile quarterback, but all day long they've kept him under wraps. And on that play, they held him to a short gain. Now Burrow to throw on second down. He's got a first down past the 30. And all the way up to the 37-yard line. 22 yards there, a first down. And now we get into the psychology of the whole thing because a lot of teams with a two-score lead in the third quarter, they almost become defensive with their offense, just playing not to lose. I think with this team, you got to figure at this point, this is a great spot for them to go into attack mode, really try and put the hammer down and finish this one off. They will throw on first down with Burrow. And down he goes. The 49ers get there. Javon Kinlaw able to drop him for a loss of four from his defensive tackle spot. Like how they started the third quarter here. They force a punt on the first drive, and after this sack, it looks like they'll be forcing another one as well. Absolutely. Maybe got their second win coming out of the locker room. On second down, Burrow toward the center of the field, but it's incomplete. Tyler Boyd, the former Pitt Panther, was the target. And that takes us from second to third down. As a defensive back, you have some weapons at your disposal that we don't often talk about. And you can read the receiver's eyes, you can read his hands, and you know that the arrival of the ball is imminent. And that allows you to make a play on it and oftentimes knock it away. An incomplete pass on that last play, and that means they'll need to come up with something here on third down. Out of the gun, it's Burrow. That's incomplete, but there is a flag down, so hang on. A big call coming on third down. So instead of giving them another third down, they'll decline it, brings up four. Now that's smart football right there. You don't even have to really spend a lot of time considering it. Just know that you're probably going to get the ball back. Good job declining that penalty. Now on is the punter long here as he sends this one away. And this one will wind up being down just outside of that 20-yard line. At their own 20. And San Francisco gets set to go here. And down on the scoreboard, certainly needing to avoid what happened on the last drive, punting the football. Sense of urgency has to take over for them here. They know the score. They know the situation. And by the way, the punter knows. And he fires one that's intercepted. William Jackson with a pick. I tell you, Brandon, it seems like this guy's been all over the field so far. That's his second interception of the game. And so much of playing defense in the NFL, especially when it comes to defending the pass, is all about positioning and technique. And this is fantastic work on both fronts there. Mixon with a first down carry. 
and he's going to have just a couple here with a marker on the field as well. So he was holding from that left tackle position. Everyone tries to keep their hands inside when they're blocking ever since they liberalized the rules where you can extend them out. But sometimes they get out a little wide and they get detected grabbing some cloth. From the shotgun, it's Burrow. A short throw caught by Andrews. And they get to him after a gain of six to the 46. He's been quiet today in the passing game, just his second catch. Yeah, and people have to come up with schemes to limit him. And, and what a lot of teams do, they'll double him, you know, use a linebacker underneath, a safety over the top. Sometimes they'll just take a corner, maybe their third corner if he's a bigger guy, and put him on a man-to-man -man to try and limit his touches. Just keep mixing it up, give him different angles, different looks, like a good boxer does. 19 yards to pick up there, move the chains. Those are the kinds of plays right there that show you why he's the number three man in the NFL in terms of receiving yards. Also tells you there's a full combination of what he's got going in his game. You name it, from route running to catching the football, that's why he's able to produce those types of numbers. The ball popped in the air and intercepted. Picked off at the 20. And he'll bring it all the way back, just a yard or two shy of midfield. Intercepted by the 49. And he may want to track down that football because that's interception number one on his career. Are you saying that's going into the trophy case? I'd put it there. Yeah, no doubt about it. That's when you ask the equipment guys to make sure they hold it for you after the game. If you play in the back seven on defense, that's part of your job, finding ways to take the ball away from the other team. Seven yards to pick up on the pitch and catch. Able to get seven on that first down pass play. Second and three. From the shotgun now, here's an inside give. And he's going to be met at the line of scrimmage and taken down. Call it no gain that time as it's going to leave him with a third and about three to go. And it brings up third down. One quarter remains here in this.